Hello friends, today we are going to study about finding f missing frequencies when mean is given to you. Look here, the mean is given to you here and this we are going to find this missing frequencies. So let us start. Find f1 and f2 if the mean of the given data is 50. So the mean of this given data is 50 and we have to find out this missing frequencies. Let us find. So look here, whenever this type of question will come, when, when two missing frequencies are there, at that time compulsory they will give you the sum of the frequencies. Because you will get one equation from this. this is, so they are going to give you compulsory this, then and only then you can find out two missing frequencies. So you will get one equation from this. So let us add this, 7 plus 2, 9 plus 9, 18, carry 1, 2, 5, 6, 68 plus F1 plus F2 equals to 120. This is, they have given us this. Now we have to form one equation F1 plus F2 equals to 1, sorry, 120 minus 68. So you will get F1 plus F2 equals to 52. Yes, you will get 52. Now you can take value of F1 equals to 52 minus F2 or F2 is equals to 52 minus 51. But that we will see according to the condition we will change. Now here we have to suppose this as our equation. You, if you want to give, you can give this result number 1. We can change afterwards here. That's why I am leaving space, space here. Now we know mean is there. So we can solve by direct method also. First we have to find out xi. So the midpoint of 0 to 20 is 10 and midpoint of this will be 30 midpoint of 40 to 60 is 50 and midpoint of this is 70 and midpoint of that is 9 by direct method by finding fi xi also you can solve this but we are not going to do that we are going to use the easiest method among all that is finding ui and we are going to use step deviation method if you don't know step deviation please look my previous videos I had made on step division you can watch that and you can understand that so first we are going to find out ui that is a oh sorry xi minus a upon h means we have to suppose one assume mean as that is we are supposing here a so xi minus a by h h means the class interval or, or sorry class length or the class size here the class size is 20 so we are going to keep there that and directly we know what we will get, get here. I told you in my video also directly you will get 0 here and negative numbers on the upper side, consecutive negative on the upper side and consecutive positive number on the lower side. Let us then also solve means 10 minus 50 by 10 minus 50 minus 40 minus 40 divided by 20 minus 2 then minus 1 then 0 1 and 2 this you will get now fi u1 multiply this you will get minus 34 here f1 into minus minus f1 i am writing it little bit on that side because when we will add this we have to separately take that side now 32 into 0 we get 0 f2 into 1 plus f2 then 19 to the 38 now we have to add this so you can see minus 34 plus 38 so positive 4 plus f2 and minus f1 this is the sum of fi ui now we know what is the formula for step division x bar is equals to a plus sigma fi ui upon sigma fi into h now we are having x bar they have given us this so 50 equals to a we had supposed 50 here so equals to 50 plus fi ui this 4 plus f2 minus f1 upon sigma fi that is the sum of this we are not going to take this we are going to take directly 120 only so our calculation remains become smaller now h h means the class length that is 20 so now directly you can cancel 20 and sorry 6 so this will be 6 now 0 0 and 6 now you take this here 50 minus 50 equals to 4 plus f2 minus f1 upon 6 this will also get cancelled 0 into 6 equals to 4 plus f2 minus f1 and 0 into 
Now take this here minus 4 is equals to f2 minus f. So this is your second equation. You can see first equation, second equation. You can either solve this by substitution. If you want to solve, you can also solve by elimination or whatever you like. Let us eliminate this because we know f1 plus f2 is 50. So I am writing here. Let me write down f1 plus f2 is equals to 52. And here also minus f1 is there plus f2 is there and equals to minus 4 is there. So we are going to add this. This will get cancelled and this will become 2f2. And here you will get 52 minus 4, 48. So your f2 will be equals to 48 by 2, 24. So here you got 24. Now you can put that 24 here f1 plus 24 equals to 52 now take that on that side f1 is equals to 52 minus 24 12 minus 4 8 so 8 and 4 minus 2 is 2 so your f1 is 28 so this way you can solve when mean was mean is given to you and two missing frequencies will be there so thank you so much for watching my video if you like it Please subscribe to my channel.